Hello, hello, how we doing YouTube? It's yours truly, Mr. Lang, Team Wash Life. And the lovely Lil, Miss Ava. Say Team Wash Life. Team Wash Life. Yo. Guys, I might have to just record this. Ugh, it's locked. I can't do it that way, even if I wanted. What's up, guys? So, I miss you guys on YouTube, man. We're gonna be, we're gonna be posting more, I promise you. We're just getting things in order. So, um, over at the shop, try, we gotta get the 325 gallon IBC tank tote over here so that we can have our pure water stored. And then just like when we're filling up our bleach tank or our chem tanks on the vehicles, we can just flip a pump, pump the tanks. But right now we're in between moves or whatever. So I had to uh, fill both our tanks manually. So at the end of the day, both our tanks were empty by the end of the day. So I had to turn this thing on and fill it up. It takes like three hours for just to fill this 365 gallon tank. It takes. And I'm the I know. pretty girl. And you're the pretty girl. That's right. You know it. So, uh. I know that I'm just, the pretty girl. Yeah, the past couple weeks, literally right when I got the shop, I had to fire. Like all my staff, pretty much, admin, employees. Uh, the only guy. Yeah, it's a cricket. It's all right. We just got it sprayed for crickets. There's bad cricket problems, so you're gonna see that. Um, so I had to get rid of everybody. So it was like no one. Devin still with me, but he can only work Mondays because school started. That's a setup. So I just hired one, two, three people. Today was their first day, and uh, we were cleaning windows, and... Hold me, Daddy. Hold me, Daddy. I'm not holding you right now. Come on. I told you I was going to do a YouTube video real quick, okay? You said it was okay. Should we go show them upstairs? Should we show them the new conference table? Yeah. All right, let's go show them. So, um... Yeah, we're filling the tanks. It's not best setup but I bought some lockers I got a badass conference table I got us a little lounge spot yeah obstacles ain't nothing we get over them I don't care if I if we were five times as big and I had to fire everybody I'd do it um check out this conference table this thing's official this is a floor graphic. <laughs> I got it stretched out because it came rolled up, so I got it stretched out. Then I'm gonna clean the floor, and I'll probably put it like right in front of that conference table or something. Boom, wallies. But yeah, that'll be a conference table. It'll be Ava at that end, and then it'll be Daddy at that end, and then we're we'll hashing it out every Monday morning. All right, boys, here's the game plan. Yeah. We're doing it. We're doing the channel. Yeah. Because I'm the pretty girl after. She's the sassiest little thing in the world. I'm going to have my hands full with her. Tell you what. Ain't you? I love my daddy. I love my Ava. So, we got to. We're making it happen, Captain. She loves this shot. Don't you? You come to the shop with me all the time now. So, it's cool, dude. It's a cool feeling. It's cool having the new guys come here and see the shop, even though it's not put together. It's very cool. So, but yeah, I miss YouTube. So, we're getting everything going. I got a lot of cool stuff I want to share. We've been doing a lot of stuff different. And uh, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but there's a reason why I cut back on YouTube. And I probably have, but I'm just going to mention it again. Because um, there's a reason I cut back on YouTube. And it was because, careful, Ava. I don't like you climbing like that. 
uh, because my business wasn't doing so hot, you know? I mean, it was, we're doing all right. We're a little two-man truck, or two trucks, and, but it wasn't, you know, it just felt like this is as big as it's gonna get type thing. That's where we kind of got. It was like, man. And then I felt funny about going on YouTube and giving a bunch of advice on stuff. So, put my nose to the concrete, and it's like, we gotta like start executing and uh, practicing what I preach type stuff, you know? And it's paying off really well. And then some. And I get a lot of help from a lot of people too. So uh, I'm out of respect for them. I'm not going to just share everything. But there's like, in general, just a lot of cool stuff that, a lot of cool things we've been just kind of going hard on. Um, I mean, just for example, for one, uh, a lot of you guys know we do Team Wash Life. One of our competitors, not really, you know, they're a much larger business than us, but we don't really like them because. Uh, I'm not even gonna. Well, I am gonna share their name. It's not that I don't like them, but we kind of got into an argument with them because they print signs. They print the same yard signs that we do, and it, like basically taking our design, and they know that we don't have the legal means to go after them and sue them or anything. We wouldn't really anyway. You're not gonna take my shoe. What are you talking about? Anyway. Besides that drama, stop. We're not gonna crush it. I will scoop it up and bring it outside. Um, we're not even gonna talk about that. That's what I'm getting at is something that they offer. This is dope marketing, okay? I'm actually plugging this company. Uh, something they offer is a property manager list. It's a dollar per property manager with a minimum order of 350 bucks. It's actually a really clean list and we've been going after it. And it's, I mean, it's been paying off. I'm doing a lot of estimates for property managers. And I got to drive. Hey, put that back, please. I got to drive. I mean, yesterday, we were, me and my girl, Chloe, uh, we drove, we got in the car at 10 a.m. And we didn't get home until 8 p.m. at night. We and the whole time we were driving from one town, like an hour and a half away. And then the next one was another hour away. And then pff, just like this huge radius. But we're doing like estimates worth 20 grand each and it's freaking awesome and like these property managers are like super super interested so we got this property manager list we're following up with them we're calling them we got admin like this is the stuff i want to share with you guys because this is like real deal how you can like scale and consist be consistent and then pay your guys like a commission and feel good about it because you got the schedule busy and then everyone's making money and you know that was another problem with this i wanted to pay commission but i couldn't keep our schedule super packed so it was like some days we'd have a 500 hundred dollar job some days we'd have a 200 hundred dollar gutter cleaning and then some days we'd have a three thousand dollar day and it's like everyone's trying to be consistent everyone's trying to uh have some consistency in their life and support their family and so you gotta build a business that where your employees can count on you and stuff times are good man so if you guys get a chance basically what i was saying if you get a chance you should look into a property manager list we got ours from dope marketing and uh it's been paying off very well i'm very pleased with it let's read some comments Brad, yo, Daniel, yo, J.D. Smith, what's up, man? J.S. Power Wash LLC, great to see you, great to see you too. Ben Baker, much love, my brother. Jason Hufner, what's up? Jason, Gulf Coast, Florida. What's up, Jason? Southern Curb Appeal, what's up? Thank you. Uh, Christian, what's up? Timothy, hey, what's up? Good to see you. Daniel, yes, we are renting the place. Thank you, Brad. Mount a picture of how you got started. See how you feel after that. Ooh, that's a good one. How I got started would literally be, <laughs> it'd be me and this little thing in a spare bedroom at my aunt's house uh, with some squeegees from, Lo from Lowe's from Home Depot. 
and daddy with a house of rest bracelet on. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, oh, Ben, I gotta see your new spot, man. We have to catch up. That's awesome to hear. We just got the two trucks. I really want to get another one though, but might save that for next year. We'll see how busy we end up getting. Uh, I mean, a sign's a sign. Whatever, whatever you want to do. Do I give a bonus? Um, look, I'm being dangerous. The moment, no. We're we're starting to we're looking into. <laughs> Daddy, look, I'm being dangerous. <laughs> Ava, yes you are. Be careful. <laughs> um, I'll share it with you soon, but actually the pest, I'm looking in, I was really looking into it. I, I'm really probably gonna do it. I know some guys use nice job and other things, but you don't ever hear about other industry or other programs because we only really talk about what's in our industry, right? So I was just saying earlier in the video, I had a pest control guy come through here because we had mad crickets. It was ridiculous. I'm right next to a cornfield. I don't know if that has to do with it or what, but um, he came through. He's a cool guy. Me and him have talked before. Sorry, it's like hard to hold the phone, my arms straight out, you know? Um, he was a cool guy. But after, I basically said, hey, I'm just gonna leave this unlocked for you. We gotta get going. Just lock it up when you're done. I said, cool. I got a text message and it said, hey, would you mind leaving a review? And it was like this just link I had to click. And it was so easy to like leave a review for him. And it, I was like, wow, this is why this guy literally has the same size company as me. Started the same time. Me and him totally talked like my first year in business. I remember he was driving around a little Ford Focus. And now he's got like a nice ass truck and like a big crew. Um, he's crushing it, but he has like 400 something or 300 something reviews. I'm like, how the hell did this guy do this? But it makes sense, his, his little review follow up thing was so simple. Like I, we do the emails, we tried everything, but it's not nearly as simple as what this guy's was. Um, ben, thank you, man. Good looks. Franchisee? Franchisee, what do you mean by that? So, uh, and Jason, um, that's, in short, that's what that's where I was going with the review thing, is I'm gonna be getting, based, I'm gonna really, I'm probably gonna get the thing that the pest control guy had. I'm assuming it's something similar to Nice Job. And if it's that easy for our clients to leave a review, probably not, but I'll definitely, uh, give them recognition when a review comes in and it like specifically states the name maybe we'll have some type of contest but not like a monetary bonus i don't think only because i feel like i pay them really freaking well as it is you know 20 percent of revenue goes towards the technicians so if there's two techs you know they can split it or whatever but it's 20 percent, which is a really good number and then plus um upsells if they do an upsell i give them 50 percent of the upsell so the way, I, the way I look at it is it's revenue we would have we would have never had anyway so they do a they upsell a driveway for 100 bucks you give me 50 of it you keep the other half you know because we wouldn't have had it anyway so good for them for selling gives them an incentive to upsell you know um but that's about it as far as payouts go Yeah, $99 guy. The only way a $99 guy would run me out of business is if I myself was a $99 guy. <laughs> What's up, Andrew? What's up, Baz Vids? What's up, Roman? See you, Jason. House call pro. Oh, the CRM. Yeah. Um, watching from my lonesome COVID unit. Watching on the AM. Yo, Chad, what's up? COVID's such a joke. You guys want to get political? 
you don't want to get political with me. 20, 20 gallons. This thing fills so slow. That's why it's so important that we have a transfer. Damn, Ben. You're too generous. Thanks, man. Remember our conversation about branching out and having unit owners under the household name? Oh. Are you really? You have to tell me how that's going. This is a real video. This is as real as it gets, sweetheart. You have. You keep telling them. I don't tell them like, like, welcome back to our channel. Oh. Like, um, like, um, the kids from, like. <laughs> is anyone else's four-year-old like this? New video. Not well, this is. You have. There's literally like, um. Like. Twenty-one um, people uh, watching, and. Like um, uh, all the kids like, welcome back to our channel. Yeah. Like, you didn't say that. I want to make a good video, like, um, with everybody else on my, uh, like, on my iPad. Like, uh, them. Okay, okay. So we need to. Right. Because they're in the house. This is not our house. This is the workshop. Right. You're right. I but want a good video. This is. Not a bad video. This ain't a bad video. This is education. All that other stuff is just mumbo jumbo. It. No, don't climb on that, please. I'm so good at it. I know, but like, usually I'm standing there a lot, like, so I can catch like, you if you fall. Like, and, then they, and then OSHA will call me, will find me, and I'll get a big OSHA fine, and then like a child endangerment fine, and we can't have that, okay? What did they were say? They'll say, hey, stop letting your people play on the stuff and then stop letting children play on your stuff and here's a big twenty thousand dollar fine that's what they say duh hey have you guys ever heard of uh oh what's it called i can't i don't want to look yet now i can't look because i'm on youtube but i need anyone who's on my snapchat will see my snap they got these things, they have like little go-karts with big propellers on the back of them. And then there's a big parachute. And they literally are like flying through the air. I guess there's a place near me that does it. And if that's true, stay tuned. Because there's going to be a YouTube video of me flying around in the air on like a flying go-kart parachute thing. It's like a paramount or para... Para something. <laughs> yeah, Ben, uh, if you're still on here, I gotta hear, I gotta, I'm gonna talk to you. I don't know if I can even talk tonight though, because we gotta get home, girl. I gotta print out, um, I couldn't get my printer to work, so I gotta print out the W9, I9, or whatever, W4, what the hell is it? W2, W4, the I9. Um, direct deposit form, little media consent form, so they can, I can put them on YouTube or whatever without getting sued. Um, we got, there's a lot of forms, a little, little paperwork, basically our little pay structure, how the pay is, you know, how, how we do things, that form. It's like 10 pieces of paper that have for each person might be exaggerating might be like seven or eight this kid is a whole mood You want a piece of me? You look like you do. Want a piece of me? I don't look like you do. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, looks like we're going home. You must go five minutes. No, there are three minutes. Fifteen weeks. 
All right, guys. Well, it's been fun. Can I say bye? It's been 20 minutes. Yeah, you can say bye. What time is it? I gotta probably get you home. Bye, guys. Thanks for joining our channel. If you want to watch more videos, make sure to subscribe and hit the like button. Bye. Girl, I did not even tell you to say it. You are one heck of a YouTuber. You're a natural. You get them. You get them. You go, girl. You go, girl. Hey, you ride horses? Yeah. Tell them about how you've been riding horses lately. I ride horses because I'm a big girl. Mm -hmm. And I know what I can do. Yes. But I wish that I was a girl and I can't do it all by myself. Because I'm a big girl. I'm four, but I'm almost turning to five. And I'm beginning in kindergarten. And my dad gave me a hard five. <laughs> and then I want to do things so I can get help to my sister and get help to my dad, to my family. And I love that I can ride horses every day. And I and I love Miss Kelby. That's so nice. Okay. Well, you guys are the best. It was fun. I'm gonna do better. Fun? We're gonna be on YouTube. Can I, can I, on can I tomorrow. say bye? You already did say bye. Say it one bye. more time. Okay. Bye. Right. Bye. Bye everybody. Have a good night. Have a good night.